hey guys uh, welcome to the, today's video and in today's video i'm just going to give a, a brief demo of the trade plan app that we are working on and it's still in beta we are still fixing bugs and you know trying to iron out couple of features but i just thought i'll give you the preview and the basic scanner is ready and so basically it looks like this you'll have some recommended pre-made scans on the main page uh, whichever scan you create and save you'll have it on the side and as you can see a uh, couple of uh, uh, scans such as golden crossover so if you tap on that you see the uh, settings so i'll just go ahead and uh, give a brief idea of how you create a scan so you see the big button saying create scan or create screener you tap on that you have an option to choose the exchange Presently, we only have Binance, uh, but we'll roll out more exchanges uh, eventually as time goes on. On the other side, you have an option called All. You can choose which pair you want to uh, scan. So, for example, we can choose, let's say, BTC. This is the one which we would, you know, focus on in today's uh, demo. And then you just go ahead and tap Add Condition, right? So, here you'll have a choice to choose which candle do you want to choose for for example for this demo we will choose let's say one hour so we're going to focus on one hour candle uh, for this condition and again so we have uh, like a lhs versus rhs format so you first tap on the add indicator one and you will get a couple of options to choose from so here we'll choose something simple we will choose um, uh, something like uh, uh, say yeah a simple moving average um, with the length of 20 candles ago so candles ago basically means you can you know uh, check for if you uh, enter there like two or something that basically means the two day ago's um, simple moving average value so that helps when you're comparing uh, today's uh, simple moving average with let's say yesterday's or day before yesterday's stuff like that so that's the simple moving average and we have to choose operators so here we could say uh, simple moving average you have cross above cross below let's choose the rising so what we're looking for is a coin whose simple moving average has been rising rising by let's say rising for the last um, four or five candles right so last five uh, uh, values of simple moving average should be in rising order so this is our first condition let's save it so you have the it ready uh, you could add some more condition like for example i can say uh, okay so let me add this one more so let me add just things like okay so rsa value right rsa of length 14 and so it's close okay and it has to be let's say greater than and I can add a number so let's say it has to be greater than 60 right so this is a two uh, condition that I want it to fulfill I can keep adding more uh, it's up to me and so just for this demo I'll just give you a brief idea with using these two things and once you have set those things and you can just run the scan it takes like briefly one or two seconds you'll get a couple of results if there's no result fulfilling your requirement it'll say no results so here we have quite a few coins which are fulfilling these two requirements you can go back and you know maybe make it more stringent so i can go back i can tap on this and you know i say i want it to be greater than 70 you know because there's a lot of coins i want to narrow it down so i can just update i can run it probably you get a bit less uh, list compared to before right so now we have comparatively less coins to compare so again same thing here you can go back to the price and you can just say go in here so if you go to the candle and you choose the you'll see the for example if you go for one hour right so it takes a bit to update so here okay so let me come back sorry yeah so if you come here you see that the moving average has been uh, going up for the last you know five or more uh, candles as well as the rsi is above 50 or in this case 60. so again it's up to you you can add up as stringent as complicated as you want there's no limit to the combinations that you can create here so if you can 
uh, choose any operators and you know you can create things like engulfing candles and whatnot you want so for example uh, if you are a candlestick or a candle pattern person so let's say for example engulfing candle would be like um, uh, to for example um, how do i put it like so today's open price this is today's candle open uh, is for example greater than the open of um, yesterday right and you can add that as a condition and the second condition you can say you know what and the close right has to be of today has to be um, lesser than the close of yesterday right so this is you have engulfed the candle but also you need to say if a today's uh, uh, close has to be um, greater than today's open so you're telling that today's latest or the latest candle has to be positive right so you say it has to be greater than the open so again uh, three simple conditions you just made it up and you can run a scam and within a second it says okay there's no particular coin that fulfills this requirement and you can go back and make some edit and stuff like that so and the best part is if uh, if there is any coin like you can actually save it and get notifications so if uh, for example if it does if it doesn't have right now when there is you will get information on the spot immediately